Hi, I'm back with another video about AI meeting recorders and how an AI meeting recorder like Blue Dot could help to improve your business workflow. We're going to be discussing three different tools today, so I'm going to jump straight into how each tool joins your meeting and the use of bots within the meeting. And we're going to get started with circleback.ai. You're able to connect Circleback to your Google Calendar or to your Microsoft Outlook Calendar. For this example, I've connected it to my Google Calendar. So when I go into my home screen of Circleback, I can see all of the meetings coming up from my Google Calendar, and I can then toggle on or off whether or not I want Circleback to automatically join those meetings. But if you aren't using Circleback for reoccurring meetings, you can add it to an ad hoc meeting too. And if you try to do this, you're given three different options. Firstly, you can record an in-person meeting. Secondly, you can import an audio or a video file for transcription, or thirdly, you can invite circle back to a live online meeting. Today we're discussing these live online meetings so I'm going to select the third option. But how do you actually add circle back to the meeting? Well all you need to do is go into your meeting, start it and then copy the meeting link. You can then go back into circle back, click on new meeting, select invite circle back and then simply just paste in the meeting link. When you create a fireflies.ai account you're given the option to select default choices. For example you can allow fireflies to join all of the meetings in your calendar, only join meetings that you own yourself or only allow it to join a meeting when you physically invite it. Inviting fireflies to an ad hoc meeting looks almost the same as it does for circle back. You simply just have to copy your meeting link Go back into Fireflies, click on Add to Live Meeting, name your meeting, and then simply paste the link that you've just copied. And then finally for Blue Dot, the steps are slightly different. The first thing you're going to need to do is go to the Blue Dot website and download the Chrome extension. Then when you start a meeting, all you have to do is click on the extension in the top, select what type of notes you want it to capture and your microphone, and then click Start Capture. Now that you know how each tool joins the meeting, what does the meeting look like with each tool in it? Well, it's a very similar story for Circle Back and Fireflies because you're going to have to physically invite a bot to your meeting. This means all of the other attendees will be able to see your bot in the meeting like it's a real person. Once you've invited either Circle Back or Fireflies to the meeting, then simply just have to click Admit, and then you'll see the sitting there in the meeting like it's a real person, as will all of your other meeting attendees. Blue Dot works a bit differently. Once you start your meeting and you either click the extension at the top or you click Command, Shift and S, everything happens in the background. Blue Dot doesn't use a bot, so you'll receive a transcription at the end of your meeting, but there won't be a bot sitting there during the meeting for all of the other attendees to see. Now we've gone through how to join a meeting and what happens during the meeting, it's on to the star of the show, the transcription you get once the meeting has ended. When you leave your meeting you've invited Circle back to, you'll see that it starts getting to work, writing up the transcript. This can take a little bit of time, but once it's done, you'll see that it generates a title, an overview, and then if you go back to the top, you'll also see there are action items. Similarly, for a meeting transcribed by Fireflies.ai, you'll have to wait a little bit of time for the transcript to actually be generated. But when it does, you'll see a similar combination of a title and an overview overview and then notes split up into different sections and topics depending on what was discussed during the meeting. But again Blue Dot is slightly different because when you end your meeting your transcription is going to pop up automatically in a new window. Once the transcript is finished processing you'll see a full copy on the right hand side of the screen and on the left there'll be a copy of the screen recording and then again an overview. So now that you know how each tool transcribes your meeting, what insights are they actually going to provide you? Starting with Circleback again, you have the ability to capture a specific insight using AI by setting up a workflow. For this example, I'm going to ask it to show me the main problems that are discussed in every meeting. Once you've done this, you'll be able to see insights from each of your meetings, both within the meeting itself and then also on the insights tab, which is available on the left hand side of the screen. And because you're able to choose what insights you want to capture, the possibilities are almost endless. Fireflies.ai insights are available on the smart search feature. And you can see a range of things from the amount of positive, neutral and negative sentiment in the meeting to the speaker talk time, which tells you how much each person has spoken throughout the meeting. Blue Dot also offers these speaker insights, but the standout feature is the AI AI chat which allows you to ask any questions about the meeting and then the AI feature will answer it. So similarly to circle back, the insights you can get from the meeting are essentially infinite. And the best thing about this is that you can ask loads of questions and get really quick answers. This brings us to the end of today's video comparing some of the key features of circleback.ai 
Blue Dot and Fireflies.ai. Have a play with each tool to see which one could be right for you. For more information on Blue Dot, head to the website linked in the video description and let us know in the comments which one you're going to choose and why.